Now Luigi will run on the treadmill. Afterwards, Luigi will start to do 25 steps. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three, a four, a five, a six, perhaps one more, seven. So it's not 25. Damn it, I missed what the boo's name was. This is a new area, too. I think. No, wait a second. This goes to Melody's room, actually. Gotcha! Let's check the Game Boy Horn. Let's see what we get. Let's head upstairs into the next area. Oh, looks like we need some water first. Let's check this face. Nothing there. Nothing there. It's probably like a gold bar in there. I'm missing it. Ow. Stupid mice. <laughs> hmm. Let's see, we have access to three rooms at the moment from the works of it. This one leads into a bathroom. I think a small amount goes. Let's see, can we suck out this poster? A little bit lower. A little bit lower. There you go. Ow! Hey! Asshole. Yeah, this is one of the elemental ghosts. This is a fire ghost, I believe. Douse it with water, and... There we go. There's a small chest here. Aha! Money! You gotta love money! Especially when you're a politician. <laughs> Looks like there's a ghost. Let's see what we get when we pull over this cutter. How? What an asshole. Spat war. Right at me. Think you need to score war at her? Come on. Come on, get wet! I think we need to leave the room first and then do that. Or we could just ignore it completely and go to my least favorite. My least favorite portrait ghost of the game Granny or Nana in this case. Is there really a difference? Like... Oh, wait, wait, wait! I think I got it! I think I got it! Yeah! Finally, I caught a speed spirit! <laughs> mine. All mine. That one actually waited. I'm generally surprised. Oh. 
Anyways, to activate this boss, you need to... This boss? This boss? By checking the basket of yarn. These yarn end up having a mind of their own. They start rolling around and perhaps causing you some trouble here and there. <laughs> what you need to do is that you need to fire the yarn at Nana, but that's kind of difficult. Map, but what is the stipulation of Nana? I was kind of hoping I would do a better run with Nana, but... Uh. No, I most certainly got bronze with this woman. I can never seem to get any higher than a bronze with Nana. That's another thing, too, about... about this game, though. For some reason, between me and this game, I get better with each playthrough. Like, it's not the whole, you know, practice makes perfect thing, you would think. That would be the case, but it's not. It's not. Apparently enough, every each time I play this game, I get, like, better and better. There's like no practice whatsoever. It's like every each time I play, hey, I got a lot better than my other uh, run through. By the way, Nana shoots this stuff. I have no idea what it is. I think it's supposed to be like a rubber band. <laughs> a ghostly rubber band. See, that's what she shoots out. What the hell is she shooting out? Like a rubber band? I think you need to find most of the yarn, the balls of yarn, at her. <laughs> Why do I have a feeling that sounds like a mod for Kirby's Epic Yarn? Balls of yarn! Oh, okay, so you have to hit her twice before she can be stunned. Ah, there goes gold. And there goes silver. Oh, so you don't have to... Oh, that's weird. You don't have to shine the flashlight on her, on her every single time. Oh, that's weird. Ah, oh, looks like we got another key. As well as a boo. I guess it would be wise to go after the booze after you complete the area. That way you don't have to trouble yourself to, um, try and, like... You don't really have to, like, uh, trouble yourself on, tr on trying to hunt them down and then, like, all of a sudden they enter a room that you cannot escape in. Or that you cannot enter. Escape in. Isn't that te when you phrase it like that? Isn't that technically the same thing? <laughs> escape in oh, yeah. instead of escape out. That is Limburger. It's supposed to be Limburger, but it kind of sounds gross when you say Limburger. Oh, thank God you didn't go into like. And... Ah! 
Come on, really? Come on, you only have like about 4 HP. Get inside the vacuum. There you go. That's number 16. Well, you're not going to head back into the bathroom, Pass Sarah? Okay. Fuck you. Ring? Oh, looks like there's a uh, door that I cannot seem to... That I cannot seem to get past because it's all barred up. Hey, wasn't there supposed to be like a gold mouse? That's not how you're supposed to deal with those things, actually. You're supposed to ignore them. <clears throat> okay, so what is next? Where, where was the next key? All the way over there? Uh, let's check. You're not going to check that room? Okay. Uh-huh. Oh! Poison mushroom! Hello! Not what I was looking for. That's what I'm looking for. In all honesty, the reason why I'm staying silent is because I forgot what I was doing at the... the wall poison mushroom. At this point, I, I'm trying to figure out what the hell my past self is doing. It's going back to the foyer? I guess to go put in that new key. Can you bring up the Game Boy Horror real quick? No? <laughs> this is one of the side effects of doing post-commentary, ladies and gentlemen. This room. This is the twins' room. Oh boy. Okay, what's going to happen is that there are these two girls known as the twins, the portrait girls. And might as well get this out of the way. They're going to play a little bit of a, hide, a game of hide and seek. This is trial and error. Behind the poster. That was a heart behind the quark. At least I think that's a quark. Anyways, when you're ready, start turning this thing manually. Some things can be rotated uh, automatically with the vacuum, some things you can't. What you need to do is that you need to find both twins. In these boxes. If you get one wrong, one wrong, even though you only found two, you have to go out the door and then run back in. This is tedious. Really tedious. If you hear that shaking sound, that means you got it wrong, and you have to head back out. The ghosts! I understand that you need to play this game legitimately, you know, like in the ordinary, like, hide-and-seek game of hide-and-seek. But, this is tedious, the ghosts! All they have to do is just go invisible and then go to a different box. As long as the box is closed. There's no reason for having to deal with this. Absolutely not. Ah. Back in OAG. Don't check the door. Open the door. If I believe hard enough, 
Maybe cash will come out. Here we go! Ugh. Okay, now that you have beaten the world game of tediousness, you suck up the biplane and the little racing car, and then you can suck them up as well. This is like one of the few portrait ghosts that you... This is like one of the few ghosts where you don't have to constantly flash the white and then just to stun them and then you have to suck them up. Gotcha! I think the the ranking is connected. I think so. Or it could count them as like separate and it goes to like the highest or lowest. I cannot remember. And that's what happens when you touch a poison mushroom. Now my vacuum it cannot be activated. But you also have this, like, really funny, like, high-pitched voice because you're so small. And there we go! Finally! Jesus Christ. Blue ball. I did not catch that. This one has like a hundred HP actually. What was this? 50. You cannot escape from anywhere, boo. This place has been cleared. Yeah, when you get down to like the last boo of the game. Oh hey! It's Mario's shoe! It smells like Mario's feet. Well, to be honest, at this point he has how many games? Excluding the spin-offs like Mario's Time Machine? Hmm? Mario's Missing and things like that? I mean, in all honesty... How many games has it been at this point? And how far has he traveled with those shoes? Well, at this point, they should have, like, no souls whatsoever. That's not a pun, actually. Did not mean for that to be a pun. <laughs> now that I think about that, it's kind of funny. In a bad way, but... Yeah, it's a bad joke. Sue me. <laughs> Alright then, I'm gonna sue you for ten thousand dollars. No, not an actual sue. I still haven't done this yet. I believe it's time for some management control. Grab some more water along the way, too. Okay, what's in here? There's that. There's the bomb ghost that appears out of the tree somewhere. <sighs> if it weren't for the bomb. How many more of these little things are there that do absolutely nothing? They just flow about. I, I don't understand what they are trying to do. Alright, where's the next ghost? There it is, and the bomb ghost. PG. Two bomb ghosts right next to each other. Wow. Well, there goes one. Now we got one to deal with. Uh, ba -ba -ba -bum, uh, not gonna work. Ow. 
Ow. There we go. Hey, I was right. There was supposed to be a chest. No shit. I was the one that played the game. Anyways. Fuck you. Ghost is becoming really aggressive. All this for money. Are you serious? Are you fucking serious? Ugh. Oh, this has been a joyful ride. 